Hi, my name is Darian Johnson, and this is my Mystic Mirror, my Mystic Mirror project. Um, so the Mystic Mirror is inspired by um, the magic mirrors that you see online. And magic mirrors are basically um, Raspberry Pi devices connected to a monitor fronted by a, a two-way mirror or an observation mirror. Um, this is different for a couple of reasons. Number one, the functionality in the Mystic Mirror is powered by the Alexa skill. Um, and number two, the uh, Alexa voice service functionality is actually built into the mirror. So um, you can push this button here on the, the, that's the right, it's kind of hard to see. I'm going to try to pivot this a little bit so you can see the button. Great. Um, so you can push that button. Hello. Hello. And you get, you know, Alexa responding. And because it's push button, you don't have a wait word like, hey, Alexa, um, for the, yeah, for the echo. No, but it does the job. Uh, the other thing you saw is that there's an uh, there's an LED indicator. It kind of glows a soft blue when it's on, and then <clears throat> glows red when it's recording. Um, so, so with that, let's you know talk about what the the missing mirror will do. I'll, I'll run through a couple of the intents. I'll start with the simple things, move to the more complicated, and, and show um, how we use some things in the Pi, specifically the camera, to to get some back and forth communication. Um, so it's a mirror, right? So the simplest intent is how do I look? Ask Mystic Mirror, how do I look? You look great, Darian, but remember, so, I'm pretty sure there's a lot more to life than being really, intent. really ridiculously good looking. Um, and then you can even do some things like getting an inspirational quote. Ask Mystic Mirror to inspire me. Try and fail, but don't fail to try. Stephen Kegwa. So you should see the, the, the next intent. And you see a fade in and fade out. Um, so sometimes the, uh, the, the the words might lag a bit in speech. Um, it's also because this is communicating through MQTT, which um, is a little bit of a lag. Um, oh, so, uh, and the last thing is the news. Ask Mystic Mirror to tell me the news. Here's one of today's major headlines. So see Donald Trump to bring advisor with Russia uh, ties to classify briefing. News and even pictures from each one. Now this stays up for a few minutes so that you can um, um, read them and peruse them. Um, so with that, let's move to the more complicated um, intents. Okay, let's ask for the weather. Ask Mystic Mirror for the weather in Dallas. I found more than one record for Dallas. Please tell me the state. Texas. The current temperature is 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Today's forecast is sunny with a high of 81 and a low of 63. I noticed that you don't have a default location saved. Would you like to use this as your default? Yes. Dallas, Texas is now set as your default location. You no longer need to specify a location when asking about weather. You can change it at any time by saying save my default location, such as save my default location as Dallas, Texas. Um, so as you see, um, we can provide the whole name, but my finger slipped off the button, so I only call it Dallas, recognize that, it, that there were more than one city um, named Dallas in the US, as for state. Um, provided me the weather and then when I um, then realized I didn't have a default location, I asked me to see a default, default location and I said yes. Um, I can still ask for weather for any other city, um, but the default location is important because that lets me get traffic and weather because I don't want to tell the location every time I want to understand uh, the time. So, ask Mystic Mirror, what is the time? The current time is 7.45 p.m. Yep. Um, and then they're to get traffic. They're giving us so late, my guess is there are no accidents, but we'll see. Ask Mystic Mirror, what's traffic like? There are zero major incidents impacting traffic in your location. Now, if there were accidents, you'd see a bulleted list of the, the five or ten. Uh, okay, uh, we're going to move to the messaging functionality, which is uh, which probably the, was the hardest for me to code, and um, it still has, uh, I'd say, a few bugs. It's hard for Alexa to understand words, you know, 
Daniel sounds like Danielle, sounds like Danielle. Darian sounds like Darren. Um, so it's not perfect, but um, but it was good enough uh, for this prototype. So I'll, uh, let me show you how it works. You know, first you uh, tell Alexi you wanna add a contact name, prompts you for the number, um, and then you can tell uh, that contact something it'll send a message. Um, so we'll, we'll do kind of a, a sample and go from there. Ask Mystic Mirror to add John as a contact. Thank you. Now it'll be the contact number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Thank you. You can now send messages to John. For example, you can ask me to tell John, good morning. So if we were sending that to John, clearly it, it wouldn't work a specific number, but um, I did set up um, a couple of contact numbers. Let's see how it works. Again, Alexa really struggles to get the naming right, but ask Mystic Mirror to tell Elizabeth good morning. The message was sent to Elizabeth. Great. So it says good morning, and in theory, awesome. I get a message um, that says, uh, Darian says good morning. And uh, this is to my phone, um, but, uh, um, you know, it would just go to whoever's phone. Um, uh, so last thing, there's selfie functionality as well. So there is a camera that I have attached. Um, and in theory, it will work. Let's see. Ask Mystic Mirror to take a selfie. Would you like to send this photo to one of your contacts? <laughs> no. Uh. So you okay. see the picture. I won't send um, the selfie. Bit of a delay because of. Um, picture is actually being taken from the Pi. So Alexa has to send a MQTT message to the Raspberry Pi. Raspberry Pi has to take the picture, has to upload that back into S3, um, as well as display it here. And then if I were to say yes, the, the picture would be uh, displayed. And in the earlier video, you saw um, how that functionality works. There are two last uh, intense pieces of functionality I want to show you. The first is um, a helper for a timer for brushing your teeth. Ask Mystic Mirror is to start teeth timer. Okay, starting your timer now. You should see down here um, a two minute timer that will run uh, while you brush your teeth. Simple as that. The other one is reminders. Um, you can set single, daily, and weekly reminders. Um, basically, every 30 minutes, the, our, the, the Raspberry Pi and Conan Pi is going to ping, um, go through MQTT. Um, check the reminders you have, that's within, I think, 30 or 60 minutes, so they show on the screen, which you can then clear and dismiss. Um, it's clear or even delete. So let's start by creating a, a timer. Uh, let's uh, remind ourselves to, uh, to um, take out the trash. Ask Mystic Mirror to remind me to take out the trash. Is this a single, daily, or weekly reminder? Weekly. Okay, on what day should I remind you? Today. What time do you want to be reminded? 8.30 in the evening. Okay, I will create a weekly reminder for you to take out the trash. So, simple as that. Um, in theory, the uh, in whenever the next reminder cue comes, um, it would ping. It would uh, see that I have a reminder created around this time, and it would show. And as you can see here, um, it's been 30 minutes, and um, there's a small reminder at the bottom that says "take out the trash at 8:30," and it would stay there um, until I um, set clear or reminders and then it would push to the next day. If I were to delete the reminder, I would say delete reminders um, and uh, Alexa would prompt me by telling me the number of reminders I have, you know, one, two, three, four, etc. and ask me which one to delete. So that's the, the major functionality. Um, definitely has its flaws and its bugs, but a great first prototype, something that I enjoyed building um, and my kids enjoyed helping with. Thanks.